Meghan Markle joined other members of the royal family to celebrate the Commonwealth's 70th anniversary. She arrived at Westminster Abbey wearing a white coat that matched her white hat and black and Victoria Beckham white dress. Earlier in the day, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex also attended another engagement at Canada House to see the work young Canadians are doing for the Commonwealth. Queen Elizabeth II wears brooch rarely seen for this reason Meghan Markle due date, when is Meghan's due date? But as Meghan's due date approaches, here are the bizarre royal baby rules she will have to follow. When the 37-year-old former actress gives birth, the Queen will be the first person to be informed. Prince William reportedly phoned his grandmother on an encrypted phone after his first son, Prince George, was born in 2013. After Her Majesty revels in the happy news, there will then be a public announcement and other members of the new parents' family will be informed. The announcement always traditionally been on an easel outside Buckingham Palace. But social media is a more popular method of sharing news in this day and age, so people may find out through Twitter. Prince William and Kate used the internet when they announced the birth of Prince George. Another royal birthing tradition Meghan may have to follow is a home birth. Meghan Markle baby name, bookies reveal here twerming favorite Meghan Markle steps out without her engagement ring again white. The Queen gave birth to her four children in Buckingham Palace. But this tradition has been broken since, as Princess Diana gave birth to her songs Harry and William in the Lindo Wing at St. Mary's Hospital. Kate also gave birth to her three children in the same private wing at the hospital. The Duchess of Cambridge had three midwives during the birth of her second child, Princess Charlotte. Meghan is also likely to give birth in the Lindo wing, although Prince Harry may be banned though. Traditionally, fathers are not allowed into the delivery room. However, this rule seems to have changed after Prince Charles was born. Prince William was allowed into the delivery room while Kate was giving birth. 